somewhere in Kansas. What are we doing here? What is he sleeping on the ground? What did he stay in that little coffin? Yeah. It's not a tent, that thing's a coffin. <laughs> Super easy to set up though. Yeah. It's hard because of the dew. Because one of the things I forgot about when I looked at this place was there's nothing above us to stop the dew. So. We had to sleep out. If you're underneath that tree over there, which you clearly can't get under very easily, you won't get dew. But out in the open, you will. But the dew was light last night, so it wasn't a big deal. Hmm. Did you get any good pictures? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We are actually only 70 miles from our destination. The sun seeker over there, she wants to stand in the sun. And, um, but it was later and I spotted this spot and I liked it. And the reason being is because we're on the plains. And I don't know if you can see, but it is surrounded on three sides by trees to knock down the wind. And somebody mowed it at one time. So behind us, is the road and of course people never look to the side when they're going by I don't you probably don't so it turned out to be a very nice very peaceful spot and it's morning time oh and I just put us here for a peaceful night and I felt like stopping anyway and I worked on my computer last night. We watched a movie and then I worked on my computer. So from here, we're going to pack up slowly, make the rest of the trip in, go get some coffee. There's a interstate up ahead and I think there's a truck stop. I'm up for a shower. First home in Russell County. Very old looking. Yeah, we'd love to have this on my property. Leaks. You'd have to fix it. Yeah, I'd have to fix it. Need some windows too. It's missing pieces over here. We could have made camp in here, that's true. Yeah. Would have been no wind. Could have had a fire. You don't remember where this is? Yeah, I sometimes put my locations and save them. It's the wind out here that's the headache. You know. K-18 Diner. This is Highway 18. Mom and Pop, as always. The gas station's Mom and Pop, too. Everything is here. You look happy. Country. Country people. Yeah. Sunday, it just must be just after church. If you go sit in a cafe like this in Jacksonville, Florida, places in Florida, big cities, everybody's sitting there like this on their phones. 
I don't see anybody on the phone. Nope. Either. I'm saying if you go to Jacksonville, Florida, or some of yeah. these bigger cities, yeah. sit down in a small restaurant like this, everybody be on their phone. I was just like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're in it. Country. Yeah. Seems like it. We're in a nowhere country town. If this is even a town, there's a gas station and a. Is this a town? <laughs> yeah, we did. We went by it, didn't we? No? Is this the uh, Garden of Eden? This is, I think, we're in the Garden of Eden. In between Paradise and the Garden of Eden. <laughs> Paradise and the Garden of Eden, that's it? Yeah, that's what the sign said. We should have taken a picture of that sign. Between Paradise and the Garden of Eden? Yeah. With a log cabin, Paradise. With a log cabin. <laughs> that's it, huh? Yeah, that's my Kansas, middle of Kansas. Yep, everybody's having a great time here. Bunch of farmers. Yeah. yeah. Living their best life in the country. You think so? I don't think it'd be for me. Yeah. Huh? I love it. I just like traveling too much. Some people got that traveling bug. Those kind of people have always existed throughout history. Three and a half years, I think, is the longest. Longest what? I ever lived anywhere. Three and a half years. Yeah. yeah. And that's only because I had a house on the St. John's River for a really cheap. <laughs> so you don't usually get to live on the river. People don't usually get to live on the river. So, I have a good deal. <laughs> what would you like today, dear? I'm going to get oatmeal and oatmeal. Okay, uh, would you like the oatmeal made with milk or with water? Milk. Okay, and would you like any brown sugar? Yeah. Alright, okay. And then cinnamon toast, perfect. Okay, Miss Bubbly, I hope you're not camera shy. <laughs> Me? Never. <laughs> I just didn't think so. I am sleep deprived and I get very grumpy, but... Why, why have you been staying up so late? You got like a really frisky guy? Uh, no, I had to work a double because I have nobody to work. Oh, it had, it had to be something that wasn't fun. I know. I wish it was fun. <laughs> Alright, what are you having? Okay, now. You don't have uh, omelets, do you? Hell no, that's a grandpa thing. We ain't got a big enough grill for that shit. We can get a grandpa thing. I'm a little dude. Look at all these no, old people it, here. My grandpa had this place since 1965, and then it was my dad, and then it was my sister. Like, it's the grandpa started that. You can't get out of here, can you? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I left for 12 years, and I still came back. <laughs> so, he didn't like omelets? We just don't have a big enough grill. Our grill is actually smaller than this table. Really? We just don't have room. Oh my god, <laughs> we're gonna be here till dinner. Is that what that means? <laughs> I want to eat some scrambled eggs with some cheese on it or something. <laughs> Look, this, these eggs here, you're gonna give me two eggs, hash browns, and toast. Okay. Oh, give me an extra egg. You got three. I'm gonna turn that into kind a of, three. Kind of a pig. <laughs> That's not, you don't even have any meat with that. You don't want a ham, bacon, sausage, none of that? Honey, I'm a poor boy and I don't need any. I'm okay. Okay, he says he's a pig, but he's a poor boy. I'm a poor pig. I'm a poor pig. <laughs> he's a poor pig. <laughs> All right, I got you. I promise. All right, man. And coffee, too, there, sweetheart. I started, but you kept talking. <laughs> All right, there's that, and that, my dear. You know, I've got ketchup and Tabasco. Oh, Tabasco, I was going to ask you about that. Yeah, uh, not like this is my first day. <laughs> I guess not, if it's your granddaddy's place. Yeah, no, um, we don't want to talk how old I am. Uh, anything else? You're younger than us, I can tell you that looking at you. Maybe, maybe I dye my hair. <laughs> yeah, well, I can see that.
The barn sure is not there anymore. Guess what goes up's got to come down. That was a really cool house, wasn't it? I don't know, there's an upstairs. I bet you there's a basement. We are in Kansas after all. What's the floors? Uh, okay, what did this must have been? This room, what do you think it was? It's just kind of a family. Cause that room. was a living room. Yeah, this one's got a I piano know. or a piano in it. And the kitchen's right here. Oh, a big old kitchen, kind of, huh? You think that was a dining room? Could yeah, have been. this is how my house was. It had the kitchen, and then, but we had cabinets here. Look like there used to be cabinets here. And then it goes into our There's cabinet. cabinets here. This yeah? house is a lot bigger than our house. Yeah? Oh, yeah. What do we got in this room? Whoa. Okay, the floor is okay. Look at this. This is strange, isn't it? Wonder what happened here. Look at this. There's steps. Long steps that come up. They moved it. Something happened. It looks like they Floor's coming through because the roof's coming through. They might have added on and then moved the stairs. This is a lot bigger than an average size farmhouse. Yeah? Yeah. She knows more about farmhouses than me, obviously. This, I would say this part right here, the kitchen. And maybe to like here, because there's a bedroom there. Or here was the main house, and then they added on, so they moved the stairs. Uh huh. What'd you find over here? We got leaking roof. You got stairs. I'm going up there. Weird. It's kind of weird, isn't it? You want to try it? Yeah, of course. Just check the steps when you step on them. I guess if you fall through, I'll know not to go. Yeah, I would say this was added on after. The upstairs? I would say a lot of this was added on after. Oh, yeah. Maybe not. Look at this. We got a door that goes just to the roof. It's not really... It was. It's got hinges. See that? Probably just a fire escape. <clears throat> but it hasn't got any handle. That's a mystery, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. All right, we got another bedroom over here. Oh, look at this. We got a bunch of bedrooms. Yeah, nice place. Isn't this cool? It's a walk-in closet. I love the curtains. We had one of these. We used it for our office. For our office. I love the curtains, don't you? Yeah. I sure do miss my farmhouse and things. Yeah, you like to have a farmhouse? What do we got to the left? Another room? Is that a separate room? Yeah. Maybe that's an attic. Whoa, look at all this. Whoa. It's the floor. Yeah, this house is a lot bigger than that. Look at this. We got another room here. Doesn't look like it was There's used for a bedroom. Yeah. Where's it going? I would have liked to have had this room. If I was a kid, I'd have been all over this room. Got another door going to the roof. Another door to the roof. Okay, we're gonna see what I find here. The Lion State Bank. February 1975. 
Okay. And then we got, what do you got? Another one back here? Yeah. To your right in the bathroom. We got a bathroom here. Oh, up, oh, no shower, just a toilet. All right. Look at this. Goes right out onto the roof. Yeah. My grandson would be loved to be sitting up here. Yeah. Huh. Shall we go down? I already got that one. Well, I get four bedrooms out of the old place. Yeah, and there's a common room upstairs. What exactly is a common room? It's like a community living room, family room. Kind of. But then we got living room down here. Maybe this is a dining room, but carpet on the floor and a dining room. But in any case, it was a really cool old house. Four bedrooms. Shall we go? Shall we go? Okay. Shall we go? We got this porch. I don't know what that room is there, but I don't think it matters. We got this here porch part, all part, grown over. Like part of this mudroom, they call them mudrooms because you should call your jackets and shoes. And stuff. I don't doubt that. Obviously nobody's been here a long time because this is what it takes to get in here. You know, if you didn't stop us everywhere for everything, we might get somewhere. You know that? Yeah. True. Why do you keep doing that? I don't know. What happened to your farmhouse in Kansas? Uh, we moved to Florida to take care of his mama because we're going to put her in the nursing home. Would you like to live back in that farmhouse? Uh, not that particular one. That looks like a lot of work. They all are. <laughs> yeah, ours wasn't too bad. Ours was a pretty decent place. You're going to get a house that ain't a lot of work. It comes with the territory. It's like a damn motorcycle. Oh, we had a five bedroom with six and a half acres. It was only 96,000 dollars. Seven L building. It's only 96. Yep. It's only 96,000 dollars. Yep. And all I needed was paint on the inside. Uh huh. And plumbing and electrical. And no. Then, oh yeah. Sooner or later. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Sooner or oh, later. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look what happens to these houses yeah. when you don't maintain them. Yes. They come the fuck apart. Right. There's no free rides on a house. Right. You know what I mean? But I felt There's safe. no free rides on a motor, so no free rides yeah. on anything. Yeah, Everything's got to have it. Yeah. It's maintenance, man. Yeah. Shall we go? Huh? Yeah. yeah. Because it was on the way, we had come through Lyons, Kansas to visit a very old, eccentric, and rather wealthy friend of mine. But on this trip, he didn't want me filming on the property. So we stayed in a big warehouse on the other end of his land, and uh, which was okay because it was an uneventful time anyway. So after the four day or five days were done, we moved on heading towards... Rogers, Arkansas, and the Bikes, Blues, and Barbecues Motorcycle Rally. The Great Plains can be a tricky place to find camps, okay? You have these circles of trees, and everyone around here anyway tends to have a farmhouse in the middle of it, one that's active, 
and otherwise you just have open plains, heavy wind, a lot at times, and a lot of sun. So it's tricky to find spots to, to stay, and I like comfortable spots. So first off, let's take a look at this place. Huh? You see it? Let's look closer. Obviously, nobody's been here for a while. Okay. When I got here, I knocked. I would have knocked on the door and said, Hey man, can we make camp here? <laughs> a lot of times they say yes. But I had a feeling about the place. And let's take a look. <laughs> See? Somebody was rebuilding the place. See the dirt on the floor? They were doing work to it. And probably ran out of money and it's been sitting uh, for quite a while it looks like so we just took from there it is over here completely unintrusive just over here in all these trees right I got some shade a little block from the wind And we're getting packed up and out of here. I, for one, got a good night's sleep last night. And it's just a night's camp. And we're going to collect our stuff and our trash and move on. I hope you guys enjoyed that little ride half as much as I did. Um, obviously, there will be another part coming up as we move on into the Bikes, Blues, and Barbecues motorcycle rally. I wish I could do these little stories in one piece, but they're, these some of them are just too long, and I got to do them in parts or they make a whole damn movie. Um, since I can't seem to help my country, maybe I can help my countrymen a little bit. This is kind of the way I think. And I want to bring your guys' attention back to the book that I wrote. And because I'm not a very good salesman, I never was. I'm just going to let you guys see a few of the reviews that I've gotten. I'm going to put up just a couple of them here. Now I'm going to leave you guys a link to where you can get a copy of that book or go over and look at some more of the reviews. They're kind of off the cuff. Um, and I'm going to leave you a few other things down in the drop box below. Also, in case I ever get canceled here again, or if you're just tired of being censored, want to follow the First Amendment, want to go hear from your own countrymen where they can say whatever they really think, <laughs> I'm also on these other two channels. Everything that I have here is also up over there. Um, those are... Um, video websites just like this one the first one actually has an app in the App Store but anyway they all have a just uh, a, a search button a search bar at the top and you can just go search me there or search whatever else you want so with that y'all I'll see you on the next video